Hi, good morning, my dear bluebells. Nice to be with you today. I hope you will bear with me from the beginning until the end of our session today. Okay, children, hold on and relax as Mommy Lan explains and discusses important things in your subject, DLE, Home Economics. Be ready to with your PPS, your paper, pens, and self-learning modules. Before we start with our lesson proper, may I introduce to you the content and the performance standards and the main objectives of our lesson. And for our content standards, you should be able to demonstrate an understanding of and skills in the basics of food preservation. For our performance standards, you should preserve foods using appropriate tools and materials applying the basis of foods. Then, for our main objectives, explains the different ways of food preservation, like drying, salting, freezing, and processing. Before we begin, let's try to answer the following questions below. Children, you follow me while holding your modules. In your modules, you can see this part in What I Know pages 1 and 2. Now, let's try if most favorite are these products. I'll show you pictures. You show me a thumbs up if you like the product. If you don't like the product, show me your thumbs down. Now, read its items carefully. Choose the letter of the correct answer. You write your answer on a separate sheet of your paper. Alright, again children, ready with number one question. Be ready with your paper and your ball pen to answer. Number one, why drying method is an ideal way of preserving food? A. Easy to store, carry, and requires no refrigeration. B. Expensive and time consuming. C. Easy to sell in the market. And D. Hard to make. Okay, you can answer. Axel, you may. Alright, very good. Your answer is letter A. Easy to store, carry, and requires no refrigeration. For our number two question, how do baguong, burong mangka, mustard, salted egg, and fish sauce were preserved? A. Refrigerating. B. Salting. C. Pickling D. Freezing Okay? You may raise your hand and may answer the question. Okay, Laura, please answer. Alright, very good. Your answer is correct. It's B. Salting Alright, number two question. Do you listen, children? In preserving processed food like longanisa and casino, what solution is used? A. Sugar, salt, vinegar, and chili. B. Sugar, salt, vinegar, and saltire. C. Sugar, salt, vinegar, and tomato. And D. Sugar, salt, vinegar, and soy sauce. Okay, children, who can answer question number three? Alright, you may answer, Algen. No, your answer is wrong. Who can answer another one? Okay. Lehai? It's also wrong. Okay. May I hear from Christian. Very good. You've got the correct answer, Christian. Your answer is letter D. Sugar, salt, vinegar, and soy sauce. Alright, are you all set children? For our first picture. Next picture. Another one. And wow, a bloody strawberry. Okay kids, a loud three claps 
and three stumps for a job well done. One of the convenient ways during difficult economic times is the food preservation. Most of the vegetables, fruits, fish, and meat that we buy in the local market spoils easily. However, with scientific knowledge, we can preserve foods and prevent it from wastage. This module designed and written to show you the different methods that we use in preserving vegetables, fruits, fish, and meat. Alright children, here is my question. What are the fruits that can be preserved? Okay, who among you knows? Any food from you, Aisha? Okay, very good, Aisha. Pineapple. How about you, Trisha? Very good, Trisha. It's an egg. And how about you, Ralph? Yes, Ralph? Okay, also good answer. Do you have any idea on how these foods are prepared? The foods that you've mentioned a while ago. Okay, children, let's study the puzzle. Let's identify the words in the puzzle. The words that related to our lesson, food preservation. That is the thing that we are going to find it in the puzzle. For our word are as follows. We have pickling. Another one, salting. Next, we have freezing. Then, refrigeration. And, sterilization. These are the words that we are going to find in our puzzle. Ready? Get it? Start. Okay, children, let us discuss our topic today. Different ways of food preservation. Don't you know that there are two different ways of food preservation? First, we had the food processing. Number two, we had a food preservation. What is all about this food processing? Food processing is the process of changing raw ingredients into food by means of physical and chemical ways. While food preservation, on the other hand, is the process of treating and handling food to stop, slow down spoilage to prevent worn illness and extend its shelf life. Now, again, what are the different ways of food preservation? Okay, let's try. Lawrence, what do you think? Okay, very good, Lawrence. You've got the correct answer. Food processing. Next one. Okay, raise your hand, children. Come on. Okay, very good. Yes, Nicole, what is your answer? All right, Nicole is correct because Nicole is listening. And the answer is food preservation. Okay, a clap for yourself for the very good answer. All right, this time, let's identify the following methods of food preservation. So the following methods of food preservation are, we have drying. Next, salting. Another one, freezing. And next one is refrigeration. Then, smoking. We have pickling. And the last one, curing. Okay, to assess your understanding and your learning on our lesson that been discussed to you by Mommy Lan. So let us listen to the question. If you can answer this, so then meaning to say you're listening. Alright. The process of transformation of raw ingredients into food by means of physical or chemical ways is called Blanc. Yes, Raven? What is your answer? 
Okay. Very good. Raven is listening to our discussion because he answered food processing. Very good, Raven. Alright, for the second question, let's try again if you're still on our discussion a while ago. The process of treating and handling food in such a way as to stop or greatly slow down spoilage to prevent food burn illness and extend its life is called lump. What do you think? Okay, Remily? Alright, very good Remily. Your answer is correct. Food preservation. Okay, an awesome answer. Very good children because you are listening to our discussion. For your assessment children, see page 15 in your module. Alright, Mommy Land will be signing off now. We will be seeing each other next time in our next lesson. Hoping that you learned something on our lesson today. God bless everyone. See you.